G'day, thanks for joining us for Saturday Afternoon Football. Anthony Hudson with you today. Fantastic weather here today in Melbourne. But with me today is Gary Lyon. Thanks, Otto. It's fantastic to be here today. For today's match, we have Richmond and GWS Giants. The Giants looking ready as they enter the ground. I'm really looking forward to seeing how they play today. Good call, Hutto. We know the score and capabilities of both teams, so it's all about the defence of both sides. If this turns into a shootout, it becomes about which team holds up better defensively. fans making some noise as they step onto the field the banners look great as the players get set to run through them the captains make their way to the center circle for the coin toss. Richmond kicking to the left of screen. Both these teams coming off good wins last week. Would fancy themselves a chance on the road. We prepare for what shapes as an enthralling contest here today. We're underway at the MCG. Mumford won it down. Here's McIntosh. Penetrating handball. Daniels takes it well. Needs a big kick if he's going to put this through. Can he put it through? Through for a minor score. Looking for options now. Plays on. He drives it. Asprey contests the hard ball. Daniels kicks an incredible goal off the ground. That will settle his nerves. Gets his first on the ball. They get around him after that effort. Back in the middle. Has the rucks go at it. GWS Giants have failed to get on top of the clearance, but it's how they can turn the ball over that is allowing them to score. DeBall to have the shot from outside 50. It on. Going for goal number one. Touched over the line and through for a minor. GWS Giants with the edge right now over Richmond. He gives chase to the footy. They can create from this. Rant's hurry kick. Cornelia grabs that one. Got boot to ball. Doing well to intercept that kick. Searches for a teammate downfield. Martin gets the loose ball. Handballs to a teammate on the run. Has to do better than that in the mark contest. A good job keeping it in play there. Markov wins it back. Finds the loose ball. We'll get a stoppage. What can you tell us at this stage, Gary? This is a classic game we're seeing right now. Brioli did a mop up. Brioli just threw it. Cameron gets some distance on the kick. They chase after the loose ball. Does a 360 around the tackler. Pushes through with power. Is accepted. Soldo gives the don't argue. Dishes it off. The ball knocked out in the tackle. Short, short by hand. Dragged down by Soldo. Outstanding pressure. Gets the handball away. Hands that ball to the opposition. Markov goes it alone. That's a monster kick. And it's a goal. Celebrating hard. Richmond deliver the first goal. 
about to resume hostilities. Guides it down. Controlled well off the bounce. Uses the hands instead of the body. And it's a free kick. A mark by Grimes. Just kicks it long. Rant dug out the loose ball. Keeps it alive. Under some pressure. Does well to keep it in play. Slams it onto the boot. Reva with an easy mark. Just not good enough with that kick. Richmond get it back to under a goal. Players move as they look to provide an option. Moves it by foot. He gives chase to the footy. The ball spills in the tackle. Gets it out of congestion. Finds this one all by himself. Giving it off with Cameron. A chance for Jacobs. He wins the ball in the air. So what can GWS Giants do with this opportunity in front of goal? It's a foot race to get this one. Gets a hand of the ball. Hopper gathers it now. Castagna releases the ball. Gets a quick kick away. Higgins marks. Uses it by foot. Caddy wins the ball in the air. Might be too far out to score. Kick this, and they're in front. Nurses that ball through the big sticks. He's absolutely loving it. Why not? He puts through his first goal. Gets some reward for his efforts. He did really well there, and gets the reward. That's a really good team goal. Back in the middle now. Jacob gets onto the ball. Clears the ball from the contest. Strong mark in the contest. Cameron goes for territory. A good mark under the circumstances. It has to be a big kick to get it from there. A chance to take the lead from the boot of Langdon. Daniels takes the mark. It'll take something special to kick a goal from here. Of course, Hunter. GWS Giants will be looking to get the lead with this shot. The umpire pays deliberate. Oh, that's an interesting call. Daniels urged on by the crowd. Prepares to kick. 30 metres out. Really sharp angle. Might be worth passing it to a teammate in a better position. That's true, Hutto. A goal will see GWS Giants take the lead. GWS Giants close the gap to four. McIntosh didn't mark it. Gives away a free for in the back. Takes the shot. Through for a point. Just wasting opportunities in front of goal. GWS Giants now only trail by three. Easily takes the mark. Moved on by Short. Turned it over. Missed the target. Williams gives it off. And now they go. Intervening brilliantly was Nan Curvis. Coaches love to see that kind of tackling pressure. Mops up the loose ball. Off hands from Whitfield. Just put it on the boot. Looking to kick goal number two. A good result there, and that's a goal for Richmond. Look at them celebrate that effort. That's three in a row for Richmond. Nine points the difference. Up for grabs for Sheridan. Putting his skills on display. The first quarter ends, and it sees the Giants with some work to do. Richmond deserved this lead early. They'd want to keep it up if they're going to win this. Let's check out the stats. 
GWS Giants have taken more marks in the 50. Their failure to convert is what sees them behind at this point. Thanks for that, Gaz. Players ready to start the second quarter. Mumford just swats it away. Is in his possession. Releases the handball. Doing well was Green. Dug out the loose ball. What can you tell us, Gaz? It's a really good contest out there right now, and it's great to watch. Picks up the loose ball. Langdon couldn't stick the tackle. Revo found a way to mark that one. Getting in the way was Jacobs. Takes possession. Cameron has it. 50 metres from home. Going for goal number one. What a sensational goal. Congratulated by his teammates. GWS Giants behind by three. Umpire ready to resume play. Swatson. Well taken at ground level. Fun time coming on. And now we'll have a ball up. Jacob's got a fist to it. Collected the ball well. Ward hacking it out of there. A chance to reload the attack now. Kicks to the square. A race for the loose ball. Martin puts on the tackle. Showing some really good pressure there. Simply outplayed his opponent. Grimes moves it now. Ends up turning this ball over. Green pushes a low ball. Picks it up. Just threw the ball. Looks up with the kick. A great mark taken there. Cameron looking to put through another goal. Takes the chance and says thank you very much with that goal. They get around him after that effort. GWS Giants could kick back-to-back -back goals. GWS Giants back in front. Grimes got hand stood. The ball mopped up. Going for goal number one. Can't quite sneak through. And only a behind. Just a few points the difference. Rant with the kicking duties. The loose ball picked up. Picked up now. He takes aim. It's somehow pitched over the line. And it's a goal. Paul kicks his first. He's enjoying that goal. The lead is now 10. We're back in motion. Jacobs thumps it forward, hacking it out of there. A lot of possessions for him. Prestia earns a free kick, looks to move it by foot. An easy grab for Broad. The Giants just aren't running for each other or creating space to work into. And as a result, they haven't been able to earn many set shots inside 50. Cornelio spills it, soccer's a kick. Edwards collects it. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. Buntai doesn't take the mark. They can create from this. Ball up on the outer side wing. Can you tell us anything at the moment, Gaz? I'm liking what I'm seeing at the moment, Hutto. A great game of football. Jacob hurls it away. Just gets it onto the boot. Coughed up by Edwards. Taranto had it, lost it. Gone! What a tackle! A full body tackle! Outstanding pressure. Good mark there. Wants to keep it moving. He's got the football now. He has the ball. Going for goal number one. No issues with that drop punt. A time to celebrate. And don't they get around Castagna. Richmond close the gap to four. Back in the middle now. Jacobs with the punch. Hurry kick. 
He has to hold on to those. McIntosh slams it onto the boot. And the mark will be paid. Williams sends one up towards the wing. Gets a hand to the ball. Cornelio goes off the ground. Graham kicks hurriedly. The contest, no match for him. You're right, Hutto. Puts boot to ball. A chance to reload the attack now. The kick from Untine. Whitfield takes it strongly. Chose to kick it. The loose ball scooped up. Perryman finds his man on the move. He's put it out on the full. Goes with the kick. The ball finds Revolt. Goes by foot. Takes a strong mark. Almost cut it off. Markov controlled the difficult ball. Drifts wide to go through for a behind. Richmond behind by three. Davis assessing the options. Plays on from the kick in. A long driving kick. He looks like he needs a spell. Started the kick wide and it never came back. Richmond reduced the margin considering the options on the kick in. Buntai takes the mark. Puts it on the boot. Williams puts on a big hit. Lambert couldn't complete the tackle. Cornelio uses it by foot. Marks now and can send it back. Red goes with the kick. Not long left on the clock now. Got hands to it. Green gets the loose ball. Mumford, the better man there. Decides to kick. A strong mark in the pack from Ward. Richmond trailing by two at half time. GWS Giants have had a solid first half and will look to show more of the same in the second. What do the stats tell us, Gaz? GWS Giants are doing a great job of applying pressure and creating turnovers. It's allowing them plenty of opportunities. Thanks, Gaz. Both sides taking a much-needed rest at the long break. The second half just moments away. The third quarter has begun. Back in the middle to resume play. Hammers it. Has it now. Martin rushes with the kick. It's a turnover. They can't afford to be missing too many chances in front of them. They trail by less than a goal. Teammates break for him. Plays onto himself. Davis wants to take them on. Couldn't take it. Quickly onto the boot. Turned it over. It's a turnover. Cameron won himself a free. Slams it on the boot. Perryman gets on the end of this. Uses it now. Finds this and marks well. 65 metres out.
Taranto with a chance to light things up. It always looked close, but hits the post. GWS Giants by two points. Ashbury weighing up the options now. The ball ends up with Grimes. Did well to get a hand in. Bounces over the line. Ashbury running off for a break. It's a very tight game right now. The ball is coming back into play. Thump clear. Ashbury heads onto the ground. It'll be a ball up. Clears the contest. Picked off the deck. Now it's a ball up. Jacob clears the contest. Collected by Green. Gets it away. Just gave it away. Into the post it goes. Inaccuracy costing them again. Just a few points the difference. Nan Curvis deciding where to go with the kick in. Clearing kick out of the defensive 50. Lambert marks in a bit of space. That kick goes out on the ball. GWS Giants would love to make the most of this opportunity. Jacobs not wasting time. Elects to play on. Kick goes astray and it's out on the full. With a driving kick. Moves the ball by foot. Ward over the top. Out on the full. Lambert coming off for a spell. He drives it. Stuck the bits out there and held on to it. Gets a hand in and the ball trickles over the boundary. Sends the ball inside 50. The ball spells to Kelly. Green going for number one. Oh, what a goal! Look at him. He really enjoyed that one. GWS Giants, 37, lead Richmond, 28. That goal will be a real confidence boost. You can see he's up and about now. It hasn't always been clean, but they've got the goal. GWS Giants are behind in the uncontested footy, but so far they've made sure it hasn't been too damaging for them. They create the turnover. Short has put it on the boot. Williams gets in a good position. Williams sends one up towards the wing. Good mark and looks to send it back. Lambert kicks it out of bounds on the full. Green making his way onto the field. Didn't disguise that well enough. It's been called deliberate. A spearing kick. Winning the ball in the air was Lambert. Uses it by foot. It's marked by Ward. GWS Giants are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. He's kicked it out on the full. He gets above the crowd. He wins the ball in the air. Moves the ball along the wing. Goes for territory. Martin collects it. Martin throws the ball away. To ball, keeping it low. Great mark in the pack. GWS Giants are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. That kick goes out on the full. Kick by Higgins. The mark is taken by Broad. Dishes it off. At full stride, receives the handball. Hopper unable to lay the tackle. Drops the ball. Corp wins the foot race. He's getting a lot of the ball, Gas. He's really having a big impact on this game. Great tackling technique. Ball gets cut off. Looks like it's going to be paid deliberate. Short kicks in heavy traffic. The kick from Green. 
A strong pack mark. GWS Giants have the lead, but they're allowed plenty of opposition marks inside 50. They need to fix up that aspect of their game if they're to stay on top. Going for goal number one. That kick hits the post, and they continue to miss these opportunities. The margin is 10. Nan Curvis weighing up the options now. Kelly with the intercept. He heads for home. A drop punt through the goals. He loved that one. GWS Giants go for Bridgman for 16. That's a really good team goal. They're looking more dangerous inside 50 now. Great reward for effort. Richmond are getting beaten at the coal face. They need to rectify these clearance numbers to give themselves the best chance going forward. Jacobs will be upset with that. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's barely touched the ball, Hutto. What are your thoughts at the moment, Gaz? I'm really enjoying this one, Hutto. Just manages to release the kick. Cornelio with a clean collect. He drives it towards goal. It's offline. Oh, the kicking seems to be contagious tonight. Now they lead by 17. Unsure of their next move. DeBorg slowing down now. Might be in need of a rest. The Giants make it a three-goal lead. Searching for a teammate. Decides to play on. Looks to move it by foot. Caddy runs after this one. Releases the handball. Graham gives it off. And now they go. Over the top of the pack. Asprey puts it on the booth. Doing well to intercept that kick. GWS Giants are allowing too many marks inside the opposition forward 50. If they continue to get beaten in this area, they'll find it difficult to keep the lead. Man, Kervis couldn't hang on to the ball. The kick goes out on the fall from Green. Grimes drives the gas. What are your thoughts after that third quarter? GWS Giants believe they can win this game. It's time to show it. Here's Gary to take a look at the key stats. GWS Giants got set up well and are able to cut off these kicks forward. Let's see what this last quarter throws up. They have to go quickly to have any chance from here. Goes by hand to Martin. Graham links up with a chance to run. He wins possession. Managed to get a hand to that one. Richmond now only trail by 17. A mark by Whitfield. Got boot to ball. Slams it onto the boot. Using every ounce of energy he has left. He just throws that ball. Castagna elects to kick. The mark has been taken. They can't afford to be wasting these shots at goal from the corridor. Needs a bit of a rest. Martin, is this the moment? Makes the most of that kick. It's a goal. Gets some rewards for his efforts. Richmond close the gap to 11. Soldo with the punch. Ward finds a way to hang on. Big tackle. Gets a touch to the ball. A clean pickup. Well picked up. De ball coming onto the ground. It'll be a ball up on the outer wing. Anything standing out at the moment for you, Gaz? This is a great game, Hutto, and we can just sit back and enjoy it. Wins the race to the ball. Goes by hand. Green gets on the end of that handball. There'll be a ball up in the centre square. Swats it. Gets on the end of this. He shrugs the tackle off there. Receives the handball and takes off. The ball goes over the boundary in the pocket. 
short. Heads to the bench for a break. Ball to be tossed back in. Ball back into play. Punches it clear. Soldo onto the ball. Asprey just releases the handball. Uses it now. He just can't get out of the action. Takes the mark. Good opportunity for Richmond to put a goal through here. Good body work to win the mark. Putting this one through would give Richmond plenty of confidence. Baker goes for goal. A drop punt through the goals. Smiles all round. Richmond have kicked the last two goals. Plenty of time left to get back in this. Thumps it clear. He's got the footy in his hands. Finding the loose ball is Williams. Puts it on the boot. Higgins doesn't take the mark. I haven't seen him for a while, Gaz. Yeah, he's barely touched the ball, has not he? Punched away. Goes by foot. Call has an injury. It's difficult to see him coming back on after that. A poorly executed tackle there. Williams puts it out on the full. Opportunity once again for the Tigers to put one through. He's worked hard and probably needs a chance to rest. The kick ends up hitting the post. This is an incredible game. There can't be long now. Davis to kick it in. Plays on. Stabs at the kick. Takes an uncontested mark. Elects to kick. Edwards moves it now. Just put his hands in the back of the opponent, and it's a free. Puts boot to ball. Marks in a bit of space. Taranto getting in on the act. Cork soccer's a kick. Jacobs there to mop up. He gives it a ride. Nails the goal. Rioli getting the crowd involved. Richmond steal back the lead. We resume hostilities. Henderson with the ball now. Intercepted. Gets a quick kick away. Daniels used the body to take that mark. 30 metres out. Golden opportunity here. A chance to steal the lead right here. Pretty happy with that one. GWS Giants goes back in front. Ned Curvis with a big fist on it. Hands it out to open space. Whitfield has the ball. He's leading the ranking points. He's on fire at the moment. Constant pressure and rewarded. Off hands from Taranto. Jacobs picks up the loose ball. Hacks it out of there. Davis hangs on to that one. Goes with the kick. Finds himself in space and marks. Takes that one strongly. This should prove an easy angle for Baker. He might kick a goal. And he's missed. Richmond now only trail by three. Gathers it now. I hope that's not serious. He looks to be in a lot of pain. Castagna looking unlikely to take any further part in the game. Ball over the boundary line. The game has tightened right up. Clears the contest. Wasting a lot of effort there. This is a big kick in the context of this game. A kick to hit the front. This game is still alive. Looking for options now. A big contested grab. Chose to kick it. Gets the loose ball. Keeps the kick low. Dug it out. Had plenty of the ball. Now we've got a ball up. Nan Curvis got a fist to it. Knew where his teammates were. Haynes gets the ball. Langdon takes a strong mark. Chips it towards half forward. 
Hands that ball to the opposition. Unbelievable effort, and it ends with a goal. That's number three. His teammates rush over. GWS Giants by eight points. He did really well there and gets the reward. This is how they can score big, Hutto. If they can do that on a consistent basis, it's massive. GWS Giants have been extremely well organised at the stoppages and it sees them being able to win the ball from the clearance. Thrashes it. He gets his hands on the footy. Rushes with the kick. GWS Giants fans are really enjoying themselves now as they begin to celebrate that victory. Well, Gaz, how did you see that match play out? It's not the prettiest win you'll see, but they managed to get the job done. Cheers, Gaz. Final scores are 8 10 58 to 7 8 50. That's the end of today's broadcast. Thank you for watching. We'll see you later. Well, thanks for having me. That's all we have time for. We'll see you next time.